dancer for the Eugene Ballet Company. This is my third season dancing with the company, so I started in September of 2008. Uh, right now we're working on Alice in Wonderland, which is an hour long, and I'm playing the White Rabbit, which is very exciting. Uh, it's kind of a schizophrenic role where I run around nervously the whole time. We practice five days a week, but sometimes when we're on tour, we do six day weeks. Um, and sometimes they need to add a sixth day if we really are crunched for time. There's a lot of work that you need to do before class. You kind of need to stretch your body out and wake up your muscles, get them ready to do the ballet movements. And then class goes 8 to 9.30, and we do some really hard classes. Um, so after class, we have a short break before we start rehearsals, and then Rehearsals can be broken up. You're not necessarily going to be rehearsing 9.45 to 1 and then 2 to 4. You know, sometimes you'll have more breaks, but normally you're rehearsing all day and you just kind of look at the schedule each morning and the director decides what needs to be worked on and creates a schedule the night before. takes so much time going from just being just learning about ballet to having to having enough perfection to do it on the stage on a regular basis and because of all the competition you really have to be exceptional there's for some people there's even a level above what they can accomplish with their body the that it you have to put the time in because even if your body was meant, it has really natural facility, if you were born really flexible in the right ways, if you're born with you know, this long, slender body, you still need to put in a ton of time learning how to do all the different steps, learning the different connections inside your body for stability and control before you get to that easy perfection that looks natural on stage before it's to that professional level. You kind of learn the difference growing up, the difference between pain and an injury. You know, pain, you can push through, ballet hurts. <laughs> then there's also that breaking point where you're doing damage to yourself and you need to stop. Yeah.